when the Prophet ﷺ came from Mecca to Medina, and the people heard, obviously the Ansar who had already embraced Islam, and they went out of Medina to welcome the Prophet ﷺ. But there was a large Jewish community in Medina to Munawwara, and many of them were ulama, ulama of Torah and Injil. And among them, someone highly respected in the Jewish community from a very respectable family was Abdullah bin Salam. Later on, he became a Muslim. And when he heard about the Prophet Sallallahu he came to see him. And the first thing Abdullah bin Salam radiallahu anhu used to say, I heard the Prophet saying was, Afshu salam, spread salam with, amongst yourselves. Afshu salam, wa at'imu ta'am, feed one another. Afshu salam, wa at'imu ta'am, wa al arham. And, and maintain ties, tie your ties, your relations, your kins, your brothers and sisters, uncles and aunts, the close relatives, keep ties with them. Those who cut off ties, ulaika lahumullana. Allah has cursed the people who cut off ties with close relatives. And so he heard the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam saying, afshu salam wa at'imu ta'am wa sallu l'arham wa sallu wa nasu nayam and say some prayer when people are asleep in the darkness of the night. Tadkhulu al-jannata bi salam. Shortcut to jannah. You go straight to jannah without any reckoning, without any isab, without any problem. A person who can do these four things. Spread salam, feed other people, feeding friends, relatives, mashallah. Uh, feeding, entertaining people, entertaining guests, especially. Such a noble and a dear deed to Allah. Afshu salam, wa ta'am, wa arham. Maintaining ties with your relationships. Wa sallu wa nasu nayam, tadkhulu jannata bi salam. I was saying these are the things which will benefit people.